I can do, sir, please. Don't do this to my wife, man. You don't know what you're doing to my family, man. Please. I'm begging. I'm literally begging. Where am I going to put my feet? Sir, I'm begging. Please. 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 That is not a crime. And you're telling me to get out of my vehicle. Do you know where Lieutenant Mingus is right now? So, no, he's not in the building? I'm not. What do you know? I'm not telling you nothing else until I find out who's driving that vehicle. You not a supervisor, bro. I need somebody higher than you right now. Uh, if you didn't know, I went to the police academy and they kicked me out. That's my purse. I don't know you. Spit me on my face right now. She spit in my face. Today's video takes us to the beautiful rustic state of New Mexico lovely territory down that way if you could ever get there but we're gonna find little Chrissy aka Puddin' Pie as him and his cohorts are put out of the building by the police so I'll sit back watch have a good laugh and most of all <laughs> enjoy it's never much audit aka the mile high auditor today we're at Bernalillo County Public Safety Center and I'm here, of course, with ANCAP Copwash over here in Albuquerque, New Mexico. And right up there, we got uh, For the Record. Of course, we got our root beers here. You can't do anything with uh, For the Record without your root beer. Yeah, that idiot For the Record always carries around a brown paper bag with a bottle of root beer in it. Of course, the police are going to ask him what's in the bag, and he always says, none of your business. It's beer. Yeah, it's root beer, but that's how he's trying to incite a confrontation, and uh, it's a, a real idiot for you, but let's carry on. A few minutes later. Interesting. Right. So sometimes, like Baron A cage style. <laughs> I've had a lot of uh, two. We got two and six we're allowed to go to, he said. The rest is like all key card access or something. Gotcha. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But I don't know what it says. But I bet you if you push three, it probably would like maybe you push your <laughs> yeah, card on there. Yeah, it, it'll ask for that. Mm -hmm. So we got the community custody program. Video surveillance. So they are recording, guys. Let's go check it out over here, see what's going on. Now these three yahoos are in an area where prisoners are processed. Now they're not prisoners and they're going to claim that the police officer downstairs allowed them to come up and there's no signage restricting them. Well, that's going to work for about 15 minutes and then the uh, police are going to show up and kick them out. Okay, so we got, uh, looks like a silver line over there. I don't know what that is, but. Hi. Hello. How you doing? Good. We came in over here, there's no one over there, so. Oh, I apologize. Are you the one that's, uh, that's helping folks over here? Yes. Okay. How can I help you guys? Awesome. Well, I was just actually, I'm right from here, just kind of doing like a little tour of your of your city here in Albuquerque. Okay. So I was just wondering um, what is, we're doing a story here. So what's the, what is, says program services, what kind of services do you provide over uh, here? This is the community custody program. So this is a part of MDC. So I'm not too sure if they would allow you to film in here. Oh really? Um, yeah, let me grab my sergeant and we'll okay. see. Yeah, cause we didn't, okay. we didn't see any signs or anything like that. And it was like open. Yeah, this is considered so. oh, a jail. So really? Oh, it's a yes. jail? Yes. Right. Because yeah. we just kind of walked right in here, like the door's open, there's no signage or anything like that. Yeah, no, that's fine. If you guys don't mind just waiting right out here, I'll grab a sergeant and okay. we'll just... It wouldn't matter what kind of sign was posted anyway. They claim it's unconstitutional. It doesn't uh, trump the First Amendment. We all know how these frauditors operate. They don't care about signs. They only care about clicks and views on the YouTube channels. Moments later. I'll help you. Hey, what's going on? Just, we were just looking around and seeing what, who does what and... No, you guys can't be in here. Jobs. You guys can't be in here recording. Uh, what's your name? I'm Sergeant Winslow. Winslow, you got a business card we can take? What? You got a business card? No. You don't have business cards? 
No. Okay. Well, um, I mean, why can't we record in here? Is this a secure facility, sir? Secure? Well, it's not very secure because we just got in the... Yeah. I mean, we can go talk We already went to security. Okay, we can... Yeah, they let us come in. Okay, first you have... What is this? Alcohol. Alcohol? So, okay. You, need, you guys need... To alcohol? What makes you think it's alcohol? Yes. Please, thank you. Well, sir, we, we already can, went through we, security. We oh. talked to the deputy down there. Okay. So, so why are you getting so close to me? Three different floors. If you why are you getting so close to me like that? This, way, please, sir. this is open to the public, sir. We came Actually, into the really elevator. The we walked right in. That's public. There's, there's, there's no sign. That's show me the sign. Show me the sign. It does say community custody unit. Okay. Well, we were told by the deputy downstairs that we can come up here. It's open to the public. I don't know about everyone else, but I sleep so much better at night knowing that people like little Chrissy are out there fighting for my rights to film in public places. So if I ever get the urge one day, I could pull out my cell phone and record knowing that I'm able to do so. Why I would want to do that, I have no idea. But it's good to know that I have that right. Where's the sign? Show me the sign. It doesn't say anyone. Well, it's not it's not the the That's fine. It says ring doors, it says ring doorbell for service. So yeah, it doesn't say not restricted. So it's a public in. lobby. There's chairs here. Service, you open it I mean, there's chairs possible. here, man. This is for... Okay. I'll just step out here. I'm not stepping okay, out anymore, man. What law is it? What law is it that I can't be in this public lobby right here? It's open we to the need public. We get authorization through our chief to come into this building. We got authorization. We didn't get authorization we, through our chief. Downstairs. Through my chief. They authorized. If you get authorization so, so through my chief. the cameras? What is it that? Because we can if come in. If you get here. authorization through through the chief, then you can come in here. But for right now, could you please step out here? It's in the lobby, please. Well, you know, if somebody comes in here, they can go through security, they can come up the elevator okay. just like we did, I came and they can walk right in I checked, I have? put in my stuff, I you have went through the like search and everything. No. Why do I have to go out there? I've been through the process to Call, be um, able to be up here. Please. Hey, you guys better get someone else over here, man. This is crazy. This is open. To, look, this is a public lobby here. There's chairs. The chief. These frauditors make me laugh, I tell you. Anytime they see a group of chairs, it's automatically deemed a lobby. Well, it is a lobby. It's for prisoners. Yeah, on their way to jail, they come here. Do you want to sit in that lobby, Chrissy? Keep it up. You got alcohol, sir. Please step out. Are you, you making false accusations? Okay, take the bottle off. That's, I got take, the ball, take the bottle off. I got a Fourth Amendment take right the to be secure in my person. Take the bottle off. And, and so it's none of your business so what out. I got. What is yeah, you're not drinks, right? You're not drinks in your business. It doesn't say no, no food or drinks. There's no alcohol in this building, please. Well, well you're making an assumption that it's alcohol. Please, please step out. You're making an assumption that it's alcohol. Please step out. Please. Can you give me information on the call? Don't you think the guy downstairs would already check that? Don't you think he'd be... You know that? Step out of the Bill. Look, man, hey, you need to stop being like a parrot, bro. We're not going to step out, man. Okay, we have a lawful right to be here. We know what we're doing. Okay, this, this is, is a public lobby, here. sir. You swore an oath to the Constitution, right? So, what is your reason for being here? Well, Please. first of all, by my what reason, is your reason for why don't being you here? calm down and de escalate? Why are you hollering? What is your why reason for being here? What is your reason for being here? I do apologize, sir, but these three yahoos can't find regular jobs because they all have criminal records. And I don't think they could fill out the application even if they didn't have a criminal record. So, they've been forced to fraud it. That's right, sir. They're frauditors. The only way they can make money is by getting you to have a negative reaction, which they then upload to YouTube and get paid handsomely through advertisement dollars. That's a real scheme, isn't it, sir? Why what do you, you need? Hollering? Stop hollering. What do you need? What I need right now is for what do you to calm need? down, de-escalate, stop hollering, and act professional. What do, what, what do you need? What do you need? What do you need? What do you need here? Well, I, I didn't actually even need What you. do you need here? I, never, I didn't ask you to come over here. We just what do you here. need here? Are you going to let me talk or are you going to keep interrupting me? What do you need here? I'm about to tell you, but are you going to... Are you a client of the community custody program? That's none of your business. I'm are a you a I'm client a of the here. public? I'm a member of the public is what I... You're not. So all you, you want to do is come up here yelling? and Stop cause problems. Calm down. I, you're the one causing a problem. You're, came you're the here, one that's causing problems because I asked you to step out into the lobby yeah, here. But you can ask me anything, man. I'll ask you to take your shoes off, bro. You don't have to, I don't have to listen to you. you don't but have you want to come in here you want to make a fool of yourself. You're How the one you acting foolish, bro. Coming in here with bottles and recording everything. When I ask, I simply ask you to step onto the lobby. Yeah, you but can ask what? me now. All you want to do is a confrontation. To be what? up here being stupid. To be? For what? Well, if that's what you think, if you think this is just a confrontation, then why don't you just go back to your office and get back to work and leave us alone? So 
that if Chrissy hasn't had too many smackdowns, although he did get one from this woman with her back to the camera. Yeah, he put that video up and YouTube took it down. Good thing I have the original, huh, little Chrissy? Boy, she smacked the you-know-what out of him. He needs that again today. He needs a good smack across the chops. This is my office. Yeah, so you work right out. in the lobby? This if you want to record, you can, you can feel free to record outside here. Yeah, I'm going to record right here too, you man. You come outside here, here, here to, and record out here. Um, you call Ezo? To check out the, the, what the uh, Sheriff's Department has to offer the citizens that are coming in here for these services. And we have a right oh my to be, have this transparent and, and see what's going on. See what they have to offer here and what you guys, how you guys act. No. I hope you guys don't act this way with the people that come in here. <laughs> You know, you guys swore an oath to the Constitution, right? You know, the five right, freedoms well, guaranteed off, by the not, First Amendment. We're not the Sheriff's Department. Okay. And if you want information on CCP, I'd be more than happy to answer. Well, that's kind of what we came in here for. We were trying to talk to that that's lady, and then she so said, well, tough. you guys can't be here. She came and got you guys. And then we got this guy, Will Winslow, over here, she acting, me, yelling at us here, and everything and else. Okay. What we're questions do you have, sir? We went from there for came in here. But okay. this is clearly a public lobby, sir. We came off the elevator. There's no restricted access. There's no signs. Has anyone ever watched Little Chrissy's religious channel? He talks about numbers. 111, 222, 333. He's out of his bloody mind. He really is. But remember, crazy people don't know they're crazy. And right now he thinks he's in a public lobby. He doesn't realize where he's at. Of course, he is out of town. He's relying on those other two yahoos. They're about dumb as rocks, too, though. Actually, There's no key card access. Well, like, you can we, let we me can talk now. There. Actually, this isn't a public lobby. This is where inmates come in, so they do have their right to be... Well, then why would you have the door wide open like this with no signs? Why are you up here? Huh? Because normally they don't let people up here just to let people up here. They have to be identified well, as... Normally, it doesn't matter. Normally, man. Like, we wanted to come up here to do a story on the building. Usual. That's all. Yes. Okay. So, and so and which questions do you have about CCP? I'll well, you know what? We, we originally were going to ask some questions, but, you know, since you guys are coming up trying to intimidate us, you, we don't need your help no more. We're just going to take our pictures here. You guys are dismissed. You cool. can get back to work, man. Okay. Thank you. Well, okay. you so we're going to hang out here until you guys leave, and then when we're ready, we're going to leave. Okay. But, well, but we promised you're going to leave before we do. So. Okay, gotcha. You know, if you guys would have just been cool. Are you guys with BCSO or? Nope. No. Okay. ETA on that 82. So you guys are, so you guys are just uh, city or county employees there? County employees. Okay. So this man on the left is communicating with the front desk and the sheriffs have been called. Now the sheriffs are the ones that have the authority and they will kick out little Chrissy and his two little buddies. They're not going to go quietly though. And then, well, I'm not going to tell you the whole story. Let's carry on. Ten minutes later. Hello guys, how's it going? Oh, well, look here, we got more guys hey, back. Come on, I'm gonna talk to you out here. There you go. I'm, I'm gonna... Sergeant Allen with the Sheriff's Department. Okay. So I'm just letting you guys know, I know you're recording me, that's fine. Yep. But this is a controlled access building, and unless you have an appointment here, you can't just stay here and record things. So I'm gonna ask you all that you need to leave. Um, this is your lawful order, okay? You have to leave. You have no official business here. I do have you official do a, business You here. do not have an appointment with CCP. I don't have to you have You don't have to have an appointment with pretrial. You have to have an appointment. I'm just telling you what it is. The deputy downstairs told us that we could come up here to floor two and six. Those are the if open to the public. If you have an appointment. He doesn't have but, an itinerary. But I have, I have business. I have legitimate you do, business. You do, not, you do you have an appointment with CCP? I don't have to have an appointment with CCP to have, to have, to have okay. legitimate business. So here's here. what I'm going to tell you. I'm going to hear. I'm going to tell you, gentlemen, okay? I'm giving you one warning. If you choose not to leave, there is a criminal state statute you will violate, and I will take all three of you to jail. Well, that seems fairly clear to me. If you don't leave, you'll be taken to jail. Of course, it's not little Chrissy's first go around with being arrested. How many times you been arrested, Puddin' Pie? How many times? Oh, I bet your mama's so proud of you, isn't she? So, I'm giving your one warning on the record now that if you do not leave this building, like I've asked you to, all three of you will be okay, booked What will be the charge? Under 30 arrest. 30. 30, 30 the charge? 20-13. 30 20, 13. It's a criminal statute to interfere with a public building or a private building that's owned by the government. But are we interfering by simply taking pictures in here? You are, because you're up here recording. This is a private building. Recording. You have no business here, Smith so you're first interrupting. Coming, sir. Smith first coming, sir. Smith first coming. My okay. constitutionally protected activity. So what's activity. the decision going to be? I'm giving you guys the fair okay, Can I get your business card? You, you need to leave. Can I get your business card? Okay. Well, then I need you to So what happens if we go to jail? I do not have a business card, but I told you my name is Sergeant Allen. 
Alan, yeah. what's your batch number? Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. Let's go. So we're gonna go. What's your batch number? Say S one one. S one one. So what happens? So what happens if we go to jail? Then do we get like do you have to bond out or do we just get a PR bond right away or what? How's that? You'll work? have to see a judge and they'll have to determine everything. I'm so not the judge, so I don't. We'll be stuck that. here until that we see the judge. You said? Not in this building. Sorry. Okay. Hey guys, so this is one of the rare occasions in which I leave under threat of arrest. Oh yes indeed, it's one of the rare occasions he leaves because he's in town for a funeral and he doesn't want to get arrested and upset his family because he's in jail. What a bunch of bloody malarkey. If you're going to be a frauditor man, step up to the plate, take that arrest sweetheart. Now they're going to try to go downstairs and talk to the officer in charge. It's not going to work out so well. Roll that clip. A few minutes later. This side, gentlemen. We're gonna to talk to this guy over here. No, there is exit no is this direction. Yeah, but we wanna to talk to we wanna to talk to the, the deputy this over is here. The exit. That way, you can talk that way. To him over here. Jeez, now but it's gonna be a quick one, dude. You cannot block the lobby, you cannot We're not even interfering with anything. Yes, yes, you guys are interfering with us. I understand you guys are trying to bait people in the civil rights violation. Well, we're not trying to bait anyone, yes, man. You are. This is we're a public area. Technically, we are baiting them because of the root beer. I just said we're not baiting them because I get consistently accused of baiting police officers simply for taking pictures, and that's not true. So this is the first time I've actually baited a police officer, and I'll own it, because just like Jim Freedom said, a good police officer can't be baited. So this is still an employee conduct check regardless of the root beer, and they all failed miserably. So what do you think about that, good people? Kicked out, and he doesn't want to take the arrest. What kind of man are you? Oh, that's right, Chrissy's not a man. I sure hope he goes to jail after his appeal's over. Man, we need to see him put in jail for a while. At least a couple of weeks, if not longer. Hey, let's uh, go into Dr. Dave's archives and get a daily double. Let's roll that clip. Hey, let's look at a couple more videos where little Chrissy was arrested. Roll that clip. Hey, Sydney. Your stuff? Which, you want some stuff? Can you tell me what I need to get What's the warrant for, Mitchell? For what? It takes all years. Are you going to take your stuff? Yeah, I'm going to take your stuff. Leave your stuff there. Just a moment. James? Are you able to get our stuff? Sure. She's got some stuff. You guys got your stuff. Let's go. Can I get rid of my keys? What? You're two? It's a warrant for. Can I get rid of my keys? Damn, you Step back. Yes, sir. Yes, Watch sir. So apparently from what I can gather, Sweet Tea pictured here. I don't know who that is in relationship to Denver Metro Audits. And little Chrissy here, also known as Puddin' Pie, were arrested on warrants, but nobody seems to know what the warrants are all about. Oh, poor little Chrissy and poor little Sweet Tea. Oh, I tell you what. And that loudmouth you hear in the background, she's dropped at least half a dozen F-bombs in 30 seconds. You got to take them out or you can't monetize it. Now, I guess she doesn't care if it's monetized. But that's Regan. Yeah, supposedly his big sister... I think that's his mama. Oh my god, you guys are so fucking dramatic. Holy fuck. Thank you. 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 Thank it's unnecessary a use of force there, officer. Oh, yeah. It's unnecessary use of force. Oh, look at little Chrissy being led away like he's a common criminal. Well, I guess if you think about it, he really is a thug, isn't he? Yeah, he stands up for what? What does he stand up for? Oh, that's right, nothing. Yeah, he stands up for nothing. He just likes those clicks and views and all that money he makes on YouTube because, remember, he's a jailbird. He can't get a regular job. What's he going to put on his application? Have you ever been uh, convicted of a crime? Well, yes, I have. Yeah, well, sorry, we can't give you the job, sonny boy. Cow 
cowards, cowards! I don't know who this guy is. Anybody identify him and let me know in the comments section. Whoever he is, he's calling the police cowards. I could never figure that out. How are the police cowards by doing their job? That makes them a coward. It would seem to me that police are rather brave because they go to work every day. They don't know if they're going to come home. Yeah, so this guy here is the coward. Yeah, whoever he is, he's a coward. Wow. Well, now there you have it, folks. Little Chrissy and his friend Sweet Tea taken away just like they're common criminals. But well, like I said, if you think about it, they really are, aren't they? Now, while we're on the subject today, let's go ahead and watch a triple feature. And if I can find another one, it'll be a four-banger. Well, let's watch this one and I'll have another good laugh, shall we? I think you need to get a life, man. I'm not in here filming people in the Colorado Springs Utilities. I think I've got a life. I wasn't even filming people. I came in and immediately got approached by this guy. Yeah, yeah. I, I, asked you, I didn't even get to film, do my tour of this area here, hey, man. Everyone's entitled to their privacy. This guy right here just freaking grabbed me. Allegedly. If that's grabbing, you are really a loser. Dude, you tried to grab my camera out of my hand, I man. I moved your camera from, from my face. No, you grabbed my hand, man. Jeez. It's people like that. Oh, did you hear little Chrissy? He said, I didn't even get to do my tour yet. Well, this is a 40-minute live stream, so you know we're going to have to cut it up big time. I can't stand to listen to five minutes of this guy, let alone 45, so let's get going. He's escalating the customers now. Right. Yeah, tell him that he grabbed my camera, man. I moved your camera because I wanted to have a conversation. Okay. When I talk Thank to you people, for admitting like look, it. When I talk to people, I like to look them in the eye. Look at him. Look at I him, guys. Look, look how close he is to me. Look at look. When I talk to people, I like to look them in the eye. I know you don't have the balls to do that. So you stand behind this camera. It's like your shield. Mm -hmm. Yeah, is that what you do? Okay. This is your shield? No, it's not my shield. This I came is, in here. Is this your story, blanket? Man. Is this your blanket? What? Are, why are you so close to me? What are you doing? This is the, the well, example you're setting for your well, kid. If right I get now? a little further, you put that shield in front. You just spit on my eye, man. Back up, off, out of my space. Or what? You leave? Yeah. Tell if me. If you don't like it, you just leave. There he is. I mean, if I don't like it, leave. He's got a shield in front of him again. What is pacifier? This guy. This guy. Oh, little Chrissy, you're being punked, roasted, dice sliced, and set out to dry. Oh, I like this. You know, lately people aren't taking this crap from frauditors. It's about time. Yeah, man. I hope, you better hope that the cops don't come because I'm going to press charges on you, man. That's harassment. Are you? CRS 18-9-111, cool. unwanted yeah. touching. You can't put your hands on people, man. What about man. unwanted filming? There is no such thing as unwanted filming, man. I didn't man. touch you, by the way. Yes, you did. You I just admitted it on camera no, that you... I moved that you, your camera so there you go. in the face. Yeah, you touched my camera, which is an extension of me. Okay, okay. Yeah, we, you we can't grab... Them? What if I just, like, grab... press charges? Let's just... We wait Okay, yeah, go ahead, man. Yeah. I said I'm not... I'm a cop caller. What are your damages? I'm what not a damages? cop caller, but... What are your damages? There doesn't have to be damages for harassment. Yeah. When you come up and just grab someone's stuff like that... Then you just feel that's, me... That's, without, my, yeah. without my consent. Yeah, but what law is it that I can't record in a public space? Well, I'm not, I'm not a lawyer, and, I, and I'm not. Okay, yeah, clearly. Yeah. I mean, did because I, you're trying did, to tell me that. I as a lawyer? Are you're you a trying lawyer? to tell me that I can't record are in you, a public space. Are you a lawyer? I didn't say you can't record in a public space. I said I don't want you to record me without my consent. Well, you. But that's how little Chrissy makes a living, sir. Matter of fact, he just published his earnings recently. Let's take a look at those real quick. Oh yeah, there was a subpoena from the court to look at his earnings from YouTube, and they're pitiful. 
Oh, $11,580 over five months. Man, that's not very much money, little Chrissy. I thought you were doing better than that, boy. Started a conversation with me while I'm recording, so of Actually, course I'm going to document. To you. He made a comment to you. He didn't start you were talking. talking to me. You asked me why I'm in here. I asked you what your problem is. Yeah. And you haven't answered that. Yeah. I don't have a problem. My problem's you right now, yeah. who's harassing me. Okay. That's my problem. Yeah, you can leave your life, like you feel like you're getting mistreated in some way. Yeah, you know? Who knows what this guy's up to? I'd like to have a conversation with him, but he can't have a conversation. Conversation? That's, yeah. I'm the one that can't have a conversation. I, I turned around to have a conversation with you, and you walked up, got one inch from me, and then you grabbed my camera, man. No, now I, I had to go live. Camera. I didn't grab your camera. Yes, you did. No, I didn't grab you, your camera. Yeah, you did, and you had told no, me you did. I tried, to, I tried to get the shield from Okay. So that were semantics now, man. <laughs> So the gentleman begins to walk away, and I thought it was all over. Boy, was I wrong. I'm going to have to lower the volume on this next clip because you two will never approve of all this yelling. Hey, I've asked you, how many times have I asked you to stop filming? Me Get out of my space. How many times? I will defend wait, myself. Wait you, this is your this warning. Is your I will space? defend myself. This is your and I have space? this on camera. You're on a, live on the okay. internet right now, man. So you're saying Do this not is touch your space? Me. You're, by coming you? up into my space with the intent to alarm or annoy, that is harassment, no, sir. I'm asking you a question. I'm Why are you getting question. so close to me? I was in this building way before you were. It doesn't matter if you were here first, man. You approached me You're and got space. right in my you face. You are filming me. Yeah. I consider that harassment. I, this is actually, you know, you're going to say my protection or my shield. Yes, I'm documenting this now because okay. you've already committed a, a crime so far. <laughs> you're harassing me right so you're now. you're documenting this harassment? Yes. Okay. So you're documenting a threat to me. You said, you, you, what did you just say? You threatened me? Back up out of my space, man. Why are you so close to me? If this is good stuff, isn't it? You can't make this stuff up. I wonder why the security guards aren't stepping in and saying something. Perhaps they're too busy calling the popo. Well, we'll find out soon enough. Let's carry on. You don't like how close we are. How about you back up? See, see what you're doing right there, man? You're, like I said, you're live on the internet. How about you back up? You're lit I never approached you. You approached me. I would, I'm, I, this is where I want to be right now. So, so you want to be, you want to be. Is this a problem? Is this a problem? Let's look how close he is, guys. So you can see my three feet. feet. Three, feet. three feet. That's like a foot and a half, man. Okay. Foot. Why would you go stand a foot and a half from me? Because I'm trying Let's to get on the live stream too. How close he is. So you got 284 people in here watching you act like that, man. Don't do drugs. This is what happens when you do drugs. Okay. And this is what happens when you don't get a job. Are you still filming with me without yeah. consent? I'm yeah, I don't need your consent to record in a public space, man. Here he comes again, guys. I'm asking you to stop. I'm asking you to stop filming. I'm at Little Chrissy got the right one today. Well, I just can't tell you how happy this makes me. Yeah, there's more and more people standing up to these frauditors because they realize they're a bunch of clowns. What are they going to do? Oh, you touched my camera. Oh, you're standing too close to me. Are those arrestable offenses? Absolutely not. But little Chrissy is going to take a trip today, aren't you, little Chrissy? Let's roll that clip. I'm asking you to stop filming. Do you just not have enough respect for your fellow citizens to, to honor their requests? Are you just a troll? You're a troll. That's 100% what you are. You're a troll. That guy knows it. This guy that thinks guy, he's going to get, he's going to intimidate me. You're a troll. And you're not going to deny it because you know you're a troll. I'm a troll? Yeah, you're a troll. Okay. Don't touch my camera, man. What are you doing? I did Gosh, not touch your camera. Gosh, man. Dude, you get triggered really easy. Yeah, you know what? I don't like it when people come up and get right in my face and try like to intimidate me. I don't like when people me. film me when I've asked like them you. not to. You can leave. Why do you get triggered? Because so I have the right to record in this Why do you area. Get triggered so and you don't have the right to come up hey, and intimidate me. Can you ask me a question? What makes you get triggered so easy? Is that just because I don't because you're obviously an unstable man and I don't know what you're going to do. That's I'm why I'm triggered. One? I think oh, yeah, it's a lot, so we're going to just I'm not stop unstable. doing that. I don't get triggered nearly as All right, guys, so we are at the Colorado Springs Public Utility here in Colorado Springs. Isn't like, like the pot calling the kettle black? Little Chrissy, this man's not triggered, but you clearly are. Of course, I think you're a good actor. You're trying to get the maximum clicks and views before you go to prison. Yeah, you got to make that money so when you uh, go to prison, you have some money in your commissary, huh? I understand. This is why, if uh, this is why if some moderators want to throw some information in the chat, they said the police are on their way. This man already harassed me. 
No, I, I asked got in my face. I you you grabbed my camera. You admitted it. I, no, I didn't grab your camera. I, well, I, you I, moved, I tried to move your shield away so yeah. I could look at you and have a conversation. Okay, thank you for admitting that on camera, man. So why are you so triggered? Is there a reason? I told you why. Are you having a bad Because day? I have some strange man demanding that I stop recording and then you got one inch from my face and tried to intimidate me? just having a conversation, trying to have a conversation. That's what you call a conversation by getting one inch from someone? I came in here perfectly polite, not trying to have a problem with anyone. He's just a troll. Have a good day, sir. And then we have this guy, John Hunter, an allied security, of course, who immediately came up. And see, you're the one that started this fire. If you would have came in, if you would have came in my job. Doing my job. Okay. Doing my job. Can I talk? Or are you going to just cut you me off? You can talk, but I'm not listening anymore. Okay. But I mean, I can talk. You don't have to listen. Well, good people, we're going to have to speed it up just a tad because little Chrissy's going to cry and stomp and have a temper tantrum because this man violated his rights some kind of way. I don't know what's wrong with these fraudsters, especially little Chrissy. I can't wait till he takes a trip to the big house. Everybody with me on that, right? Ten minutes later. I'm going to keep the camera on whoever I want, bro. You're not the boss of me, man. This guy, man, thinks he's going to tell me what to do. Mr. John Hunter from Allied Security. So if you're just coming in, guys, the police are on their way. Uh, Mr. John Hunter from Allied Security uh, immediately came up to me and got right in my face and told me I can't record in here because people have personal information. And then that caused a spark, sparked a reaction that a customer got right in my face and he hit my camera away. And he got one inch from me trying to intimidate me, man. Little Chrissy should stick to his religious channel. He's a lot better at that than he is at this. 222, 333, 444, and so on and so forth. Uh, let's skip ahead a little bit more. 11 minutes later. Are you Mr. Williams? No, I'm not Mr. Williams. I'm covering him down here. Williams is the guy that called you. He's the supervisor of College Spring Security. Okay. You're not Mr. Williams either. No. So, Mr. Williams is one of our top first and center guys that calls you guys. Uh, this gentleman's in here recording. I'm asking him to stop and leave. Okay. He's refusing to leave. He's not here for actual business, and this is actual business, so he's disrupting business. Okay. We're going to leave. Uh, he was very clear that he said he was not going to leave unless he was arrested and put in handcuffs. So, I would like him to leave. I'm so trespassing. Whatever we got to do. Okay. Is your preference for him to leave? He's going to leave. Okay. So. All right. Professor. I'm Corporal Wilbury. I'm a Colorado Springs police officer. Um, the gentleman in charge of the buildings made it clear that you're not welcome here. Oh, excuse me, officer, but that would violate the lad's First Amendment right to freedom of the press, not to mention his freedom of speech. And now, my goodness, he has to be able to redress his government. Oh, it just violates the First Amendment all around, sir. Um, this is what's called public-private, so it's open to the public. You can come in, you can conduct business. Um, if you don't have a reason to be here and you're not conducting business, they can ask you to leave at that point, okay? You're the um, corporal? Yes. Okay. Um, he's made it clear that you're no longer welcome here if you've finished business. So I'm gonna give you, it is now 147. I'll give you till 150 to leave the premises, okay? So, okay? Well, uh, before you go, uh, let me just explain to you that you, you don't know that I, oh, can I talk? I, let, I didn't interrupt you the whole time. I let you say your whole thing. Let me respond to you, okay? The 150 is, is a hard deadline, okay? okay? I want so you I, to understand you're using I, I your understand time. that. We can continue the conversation on the sidewalk if you like. Okay. So uh, you're interrupting my time, so. Notice how little Chrissy wants to interrupt the officer. I listened to you, now it's my turn. A sure sign of a narcissistic, sociopathic behavior, no doubt. And little Chrissy also suffers from the Napoleon complex. What is he, about five foot four? Well, let's give him a couple inches. Five foot six, yeah. Yeah, but he suffers. Oh, just a little baby boy. I don't know what happened to his live stream. It just skipped ahead. I don't know. Maybe he's got some faulty equipment. But I'm going to fix it. Don't worry. Let's continue.
you're a corporal, man. You look like you're a pretty seasoned officer here. And you don't understand that you, you don't have... Uh, 49. You don't understand that you can't trespass from public property? You don't understand that? You don't understand that you can't trespass from public property unless I commit a crime? Corporal? It's 150. You are now being detained for the crime of trespass. I'm going to okay. issue you a citation. Set the camera down. Put your hands behind your back. Okay, hold on. Let me just move this. Get this so that it doesn't get messed up. All right, guys, I'm getting arrested right now. Little Chrissy is so thoughtful to keep his viewers informed. Okay, guys, I'm getting arrested now. Right, right, right. Thank you so much for that update, little Chrissy. He's putting me in handcuffs. Put your hands behind your back. Would you like me to carry your camera for you? Yes. I'm going to double lock these so they don't tighten up. Nobody cares about your rights, little boy. Matter of fact, you have the right to remain silent. Use that right. Hey, maybe you can call AFA and Leroy Truth. They'll help bail you out. Well, folks, there's nothing else to see in this video. He just gets walked out to the police car, and then the video cuts off. Oh, man, this is what happens, little Chrissy, when you think you know everything, but you really know nothing. Oh, man, when is your sentencing? Isn't your sentencing later this month? That's going to look real good, no doubt. The judge is going to love that. He's going to give you the maximum on top of the maximum. Well, not to worry, good people, if you enjoy watching stupid people do stupid things on my channel, please subscribe. <laughs> As always, thanks so much for stopping by, little Chrissy. Better call your mama. Cheers to that. I've actually studied English, and uh, I have a, over a 400-level education in English. I'm not sitting down. I refuse to sit down. I refuse. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. What are you gonna do about it? Nothing. Nothing. You can come try to make me. You're welcome to try to make me. Take a swing. Take a swing. What is the reason for calling the officers here? Oh, no I'm reason. Really, has... I'm really, I'm really unhappy that somebody did this to me. We're gonna arrest you for trespassing in a minute. On um, public property? Yeah. We're asking you to leave, and you're not leaving. That's trespassing. She's, oh, she's right in my face, guys. You can't t come up and touch me like that. You don't have permission to film me in any space. I don't need permission to, yes, to you record do. you in public, man. Actually, no, that's the law. Do. Oh, is that like a law? It's against the line. Oh, what law is that? Funny, because I've never heard about that. I pay for that uniform, I pay for that car, I'm the taxpayer, right? You work for me, right? You're just a little guy. You're just a little guy. You work for me. You are a public servant. You are a public servant. You work for me. 